everyone, welcome to your bar segment. Today we're going to work on thighs, seat, side seat, a little bit of hamstrings. And we have some optional props. I have been buying some things on Amazon. I'll post the link um, in the Facebook group of these cool resistance bands and I love them because of the color just as much as what they help me to achieve in my workouts. I finally got myself some weights um, that were super cheap and boy were they heavy when they arrived in the box. And we'll need a chair today, so I just pulled in a chair from the kitchen. This one's a little low actually, so I would prefer when you're work, working through here, we're going to come to stand in front <clears throat> of the chair that we've got our hands sliding down that back jeans pocket and place them lightly on the chair behind you. It'd be nice if it was a few inches high, but I don't have any other chairs. If you do have resistance bands, you can place them, band, place the band, about three inches above your knees. Um, it's optional though, and you'll still get a great workout. So this is about a 15 minute segment for the legs and the seat. We'll bring our legs zipped up in one long line of energy, Heels connect, you're in a first position, tone through the belly, roll the shoulders back and down, gently hold onto the chair behind you, elbows draw straight back, soft bend in those elbows, and then extend the right leg out to the side, point the toes, and soften through the left knee the entire time. So the left thigh is going to get just as much work here. And note that I've got my special bar socks on, so if you're on hardwood floors, Please wear bar socks or no socks at all is, is just as good. So we don't want anybody slipping. So from here, we're going to lift up an inch, down an inch, up an inch and down an inch. Little up, little down. Eight, down. Seven, down. Six, five. Keep that length from the hip to the tip of your toe. Keep that left knee nice and soft. Two, hold it up, pulse it here, pulse it up, little pulses up, pulse and pulse. Eight, seven, seeking length over lift. Four, three, up for two, down for two. Up, up, down, down. Toes up, toes up, down and down. Up, up, keep the left knee nice and soft. Four, up, down, and down. Three, up, down, down. Two, up, down, and down. One, hold it here, pulse it up. Up, little pulses up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, all the way down, all the way up, down, and up. Toe down, toe up, eight, lift, seven, lift. Keep the spine nice and long. The shoulders are soft. Four, three, two, one. Hold it here, pulse it up, up. Little pulses up, just eight, seven, six, five. You've got two more changes, two, and one, hold it here, little bend, big press. Bend and press, bend the knee, press it straight. Keep the left knee nice and soft. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold it here, pulse to finish, pulse it up, up. Little pulses up, a nice long length from the hip to the toe. Just eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold it here, optional releve on that left foot. Lift it up, pulse for 10. Pulse it here, here. The left arm comes up. Just eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let me sit down, good work. We'll stretch it out in a moment. Let's move to the left side. 
So toes out, heels in, you're connecting the heels in that first position and zip up through the length of your legs. Nice long lines in the body as we work through our bar segments. Holding onto that chair behind you, soft placement of the fingers on that support. Bend through both knees. Soft bend, extend the left leg nice and long. Point the toe, keep that right knee soft the entire time. Up an inch, down an inch. Up and down. Little up, little down. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold it here, pulse it up. Little pulses up, little pulse. Keep that right knee nice and soft. The tummy pull tight. The shoulders back and down. Just eight, seven, six, five, four, three, up for two, down for two, up, up, down, and down. Toes come up, little up, down, and down. Make the movement nice and small. Down and down. Eight, lift, down, down. Seven, lift, down, and down. Six, lift, down, down. Five, lift, down and down. Keep that right knee nice and soft. Down and down. Just three. Lift, down and down. A nice long leg. The height is not important. Last one. Hold it here. Pulse it up. Up. Little pulses up. Length from the hip to the tip of your toe. Just eight, seven, six, five, four, three, all the way down, all the way up. Toe comes down, toe comes up. Down and up. Down and up. Eight, lift. Seven, lift. Six, five. Keep on breathing. Four, three, two. Hold it here and pulse it up. Pulse and pulse. Two more changes, we are almost there. Just eight, seven, keep that left leg nice and long. Keep the right knee nice and soft. Tummy tuck tight, collarbones are broad. Just four, three, two, one. Hold it up, taking the combo. Little bend, big press, little bend, big press. Bend and press, eight, press, seven, press, six, Press, five, press, don't lean into the support. Four, press, stay nice and tall. Just two, press, one, hold it here, pulse it, finish, pulse it up, up. Just eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it here. Come up onto that optional releve onto the right foot, the heel is high. Just up and down for eight, eight, seven, six, five. Take the right arm up, four, three, two, and one. Release it down, good work. Release the band if you are using one. And I'll show you when to buy them on Amazon after I finish. And take a nice half fold over your chair. So I'm going to keep my feet hip width distance apart. My knees are nice and soft if that supports your hamstrings and your hip flexors. And your spine is nice and long. Tone through the belly, even here. Breathe deeply. Press yourself up, holding onto your support. So you can see why mine's just a little low, but cross left foot over your right thigh and sit back. You can also sit onto your mat or lie onto your backs and take a supine figure four, if you prefer, keeping the spine nice and long, opening through that left hip flexor and the left side seat. Press up and switch sides, cross right foot over left thigh and sit back. Feel the opening on the outer edge of the right hip. Let it feel good, spine stays nice and long, tummy stays toned, breathe deeply. 
Press yourself up. Come onto your mat, friends, and we'll work the seat and the side seat. So I might change my rotation as we're working through just so that you can see the position of my body. If you have a weight, you can use that and that would be a great um, addition to bring more focus and strength to your workout. If you don't, I'll make it hard enough so that uh, it's just fine without the weights. So if you have a weight, you can place it into the crook of your right knee. And I'll turn around so that you can see me here. And we're on all fours. If you're staying on your hands, your wrists are directly over your shoulders, tone through the belly. So pull the belly button in, lengthen through the spine. Now draw the tailbone down, slight tuck so that you protect the lower spine. We don't want you swaying and I don't want to see any of this curving through the spine. If it's better for your body to come to your forearms like it is for me, you can do that. This is not easier. Again, tone through the belly. We don't want this. We want this. Toning through the belly, lengthening through the spine, tuck through the tailbone. Lift up the right foot. Point the toe. Remember the weight's there. All the way down and all the way up. Knee down, toes up. Down and up. Down and up. Eight. Lift. Seven, six, five. Keep toning through the belly. Four, three, two, one. Hold it up. Pulse it here. Pulse it here. Pulse the toes up. Pulse them up. Just eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold it here. Reconnect to your alignment and positioning. Your heel is lifted, toes are pointed. Cross the right knee behind the left calf. Here we go. Cross and lift. Cross and lift. Cross, lift. Eight, lift. Seven, lift. Six, lift. Five, lift. Four, lift. Three, Lift, two, lift, one, hold it up, pulse in place, pulse it up. It's a teeny tiny movement. Eight, seven, should feel it on your center seat. Four, three, two, hold it here, one inch up and one inch down. Lift and lower, little up, little down. Teeny tiny movement, an inch up and down, just an inch up, an inch down, eight, and down, seven, and down, barely moving, five, four, three, two, hold it here, pulse it up, little pulses up, pulse, and pulse, I know it burns, it burns for me, just eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two static hold, lift it one more inch. We're going to bend the heel into the glute. It's a teeny tiny movement. You might have the weight. Here we go. In and out. In and out. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. You're squeezing heel to glute. Two and one. Hold it here. Pulse it up. Pulse it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, all the way down, all the way up, down, and up. I know it burns, we're almost there. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Hold it up, pulse to finish, pulse it here, this is it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it up. Place your left forearm parallel to the top of your mat. Open the right leg out, you're in that fire hydrant position. I'm going to rotate my orientation so you can see my alignment here. So left forearm parallel with the front of your mat. You can move that weight off if that's just better for you now. We'll flex the toes down and up. Down and up. Eight, working side seat. Seven, six, 
five, four, three, two. Hold it here, pulse it up, 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 eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Release it down, release the weight. It's slipping for me a little bit, so we'll remove it for safety. Come back to that side seat, flex the toes, down an inch, up an inch, down and up, down and up. Eight, seven, six. Keep the neck nice and long. Look three feet ahead of you. Four, three, two. Hold it here, pulse it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it here. Release it down, good work. Sit back to your quick child's pose. We'll stretch afterwards, forehead to the mat. Knees wide, big toes to touch, breathe deeply. Great work, everyone. Let's do the other side. So this time we're working the left seat and the left side seat. So we'll take that weight if you chose to use one and it's not easy with or without the weight. So I'm sure you can attest now that you're in it, but we're in it to win it with the glutes. So here we go. On your hands, stack shoulders directly over wrists or come onto your forearms, but tone through the belly. Protect your lower spine. Don't compromise your form at all, friends. Lift up the left foot. Create that 90 degree angle. Point the toe. Down and up. Here we go. Down and up. Down and up. Down and up. Knee down, toes up. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, hold it here, pulse it up, 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 little pulses up, teeny tiny movement, just eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, static hold, hold it here, lift it one more inch, return to focus on your alignment, engage the belly, cross the left knee behind the right calf, here we go. Cross and lift, cross and lift, cross it over, lift it up, down and up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it up, pulse it up, pulse and pulse, the little pulses up, just eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, static hold. Lift it one more inch, keep it lifted. Tone through the belly, lengthen through the spine. Down an inch, up an inch, down and up, down and up. We've got two more changes after this. Up, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, hold it here, heel to glute. It's a teeny tiny movement, take it in, back, in and back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it here, pulse it up, 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 little pulses up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, down and up to finish. Take it down and up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Don't swing the leg, use control. I can see you virtually. Hold it here. And then take the right forearm parallel to the front of your mat. Left hand comes out to the side. Lift up the left knee out to the side in that fire hydrant position. Let me switch rotation so you can see my position. Flex the toes down and up, down 
and up, down and up, eight, seven, six, five, keep toning through the belly, keep the neck nice and long, no wrinkles in the back of the head, four, three, two, hold it up, pulse it up, flex the toes, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it here, stand it, hold, release the leg down for a moment, release that weight, as we get tired, I don't want anybody to get injured by dropping weights or anything, so we're removing that, and we're just focusing on our body strength and resistance, up to 90, flex the toes, down and up, down and up, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it here, pulse to finish, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, release it down, great work everyone, sit back, take an embryo pose so the knees are together, the arms come behind you, forehead to the mat, or to a fist to bring the earth closer, palms to the sky. Breathe deeply. From here, come into a Supta Baddha Konasana. Soles of the feet will touch, knees will butterfly open. Very gently allow the knees to soften. Sit nice and tall, draw the belly in, soften and pull in the front ribs. Draw the shoulders back and down, breathe deeply. And then inhale, cross the left leg in front of the right, you're in Zukasana, easy seat. Inhale, arms come up and gently twist over, left hand onto right thigh, right hand behind you. Inhale, lift and lengthen. Exhale, begin to twist. Breathe deeply. Inhale through center. Exhale, right hand onto left thigh, left hand behind you. Inhale, lift and lengthen. Exhale, gently twist. Inhale to lengthen. Exhale to twist. Inhale, come back through center. We'll take some cat cow. So you're Sitting in your cross-legged position, you can switch the cross legs, now the right leg is in front, just so we feel even, and then hollow through the back, so you're rounding in, pulling the belly in, inhale, exhale, goal posting arms, press the chest forward, four more times, inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale, two more, inhale, exhale, last time, inhale, curl in, Exhale, press open. Extend the legs nice and long out in front of you. Paschimottanasana. Sit well on your sit bones. Place your hands beside you. Dandasana, staff pose. Sit nice and tall. First, roll the shoulders back and down. Pull the belly in. Knit those front ribs in. And then inhale, the arms come up. Bend the knees as much as you need to. Reach for those big toes with peace fingers and thumbs. Inhale, lift and lengthen. Exhale, you gently soften in. I have very tight hamstrings, so I keep my knees nice and bent. If you have the flexibility to begin to straighten your legs and lean forward, please do so, but try to maintain a nice long spine. One more round of breath. And then inhale, reach the arms up. And draw the hands through heart center. And then Please feel free to look at another segment of work to cool down. Otherwise, thank you so much.